couple of days ago I did that. It took six months. aircraft such as the Phantom and the early Tornado F2 in service uh, as our fighter, which had a sustained rate of turn of about 17, 18 degrees per second, uh, which told us very clearly that this was not an aircraft to mess with in the visual environment. And one of the reasons for that is that uh, the flanker had fly-by-wire controls, which was the first time a production Soviet fighter had had that. Su-27s were taken on by the Ukrainian Air Force when the country became independent from the Soviet Union and they carried on serving in the same roles as they had back in Soviet times. Apart from the flankers like this one at the 831st,
of, because of the size of the aircraft and how close it appears to be. Apart from the aircraft from the unit at uh, Mirhorod, like this one is a smaller Su-27 squadron stationed at Tsarna in the north of Ukraine. The standard armament much the same as it was in the Soviet era. Medium range R-27 and short range R-73 air-to-air missiles, a maximum of 10 in all. Plus the aircraft has an internal 30mm cannon. And they say they practice close air support with these aircraft, so presumably because of the lack of air-to-ground stores, they would use the cannon for that. Now, we can tell this is an upgraded flanker because of the so-called pixelated colour scheme that's applied in blue, and that is put on the aeroplanes after they undergo a general overhaul. The same is true of other Ukrainian Air Force aircraft. after the upgrade done locally by the Zaporozhi State Air Repair Plant was accepted into service. to the sort of flying that they practice on a daily basis back in Ukraine. Of course, they do one versus one, two versus two, aerial combat, and then it said melee. I like the sound of that. And there's that big air brake extended once again as the aircraft comes into land. The Ukrainian Air Force Sukhoi Su-27 P-1M. Dynamic braking going on as well, holding the nose wheel off, and we're just about to see two very large brake chutes come out of the back. Wonderful display. <laughs> 